in teaching circuits, uh, there are really three aspects. One is uh, theory and the concepts involved, and one does that uh, through lecturing and uh, interaction with the students. Uh, then uh, there is uh, circuit simulation, which enables the students to take a circuit, uh, simulate it after they have analyzed it, and then compare the results. The third aspect is experimenting with the circuit in the laboratory, and then you have then you have three sets of results, if you wish, uh, results of your own analysis of the circuit, the results of the simulation, and then the experimental results, and these three together should reinforce your and one's understanding, the student's understanding of the circuit, uh, how it works, and uh, its shortcomings, the, the shortcomings of the design. It's my view that we have never really, uh, as educators, we have never really got these three elements to work together very well. And the weakest, in my view, has been the laboratory. Hopefully, with uh, the advances in simulation and with multi-sim, and the advances in experimentation uh, with uh, my deck, we will be able to bring all these elements together in an even more exciting way.